Well, sir, I put my house horses to work, but they haven't got anything concrete yet. I need a little bit more time. Do you really not realize that the more time he's outside, his popularity keeps increasing? The whole public focus is shifting to the war! We know that, sir. That the focus is shifting towards the war. I think we need to dig deeper into his personal life. I don't care what you think, I don't care what you do. 72 hours, that's all you got. Either you get me something useful or I'll get myself someone who can. Surely, sir, something will be done. Sir, Charlie's movies is increasingly becoming more and more politically driven and this can create a huge furor. So especially Charlie's popularity is still on the rise. You think I don't know that? Why do you think I've been tailing him? Anyway, what have you guys got, what have you guys got on him? Sir, I don't think that we can get anything that will stick. Besides that, sir, what Mr. Hopkins has got for you is more than what you could gather. Not exactly, sir. I got something that might interest you. I, got, I found out that Charlie had two divorces and several affairs. And he incidentally he even got married to a 16 year old girl and her name was Mildred Harris. Oh yeah, nice work Steve, nice work. I might even uh, put in a word for your raise, huh? Hmm. Anyway, now taking your information into account, what we can do is, we can publish the fact that his image with his affairs and his divorces don't go with the American dream of family love, etc. I just need to get into the papers. Mr. Adams, who in your party is linked to the papers? That is Matthew, sir. Who's Matthew? Me, sir. What do you need, sir? Well, I need something published. How fast can it be done and uh, how far will, it, will its reach be? It will be done as soon as possible, sir. And as far as DG is concerned, my links in the newspaper is with Mr. Pego, whose syndicated column runs in hundreds of newspapers, including Times. Hmm, good for you. Do one thing, get him to publish the fact that Charlie Chaplin with his divorces and his affairs, his image does not go with the American dream of uh, family love, etc. Okay, sir. It will be done on priority. Okay. Well, sir, we want to share something with you about Chaplin. His affair with the inspiring lady, Don, named Jane John Mary. If you say, sir, you can file a penalty suit, God that and more, maybe. What do you say, sir? Nice work, Mr. Adams. Didn't expect it from you. Okay, fine. Let's do that. What we can do is, we can accuse him of violating the man act. We'll say that he was trafficking Joel Mary. Let's see where it goes from there. Yes, sir. Okay, sir. After last meeting, I doubled my investigation on him. But sir, there is absolutely no proof that he is associated with the communists. Sir, do you really feel that a star like him... I do not care how big a superstar he may be! No one demeans J. Edgar Hoover and gets away with it! This Charlie 
Admin chapter has been going on for too long. Sir, is the newspaper deal still on? Like, can we use them? Yeah, that's all. Oh, that's a great news, sir. I certainly know that we cannot prove anything, but we can certainly spread the rumor to Chaplin being Soviet friendly. And even I got to know that he is leading on the second front and helping in helping Soviet groups for campaigning. And he even he got acquaintance with Soviet American groups. You're right, sir. We can definitely do, do that. The thing is that, but that still does not solve the problem of getting him out of the picture. What we need to do is get him out of the country and keep him there. Something that came to my notice was, Charlie, I think, is planning a trip to England. Once he's there, what we can do is, we can catch his re-entry form. He can't get back. What do you say? Yeah, that would be a great idea.